Hello everyone, welcome to today's assignment, Strategies for Learning Mathematics. It's our second series in the growth mindset lessons that we have been doing. And um, I want you to use this Google slide presentation to complete the activities. Each of you will be given your own copy. There will be things at the end that you'll have to use other um, links for, but I will put that into the Google Classroom and with the explanations there. So what you're going to do on this assignment is watch the video first, and I will let you do that on your own time, and so I won't do that now. And then you're going to do a notice and wonder. So there's this picture here, and on the next slide, you're going to fill in what you notice and wonder about the picture. So what do you notice? What do you wonder? And you can fill in the um, spaces here in order to notice and wonder about these rod trains. These are called rod trains or Cuisinaire rods. What do you notice and what do you wonder about the Cuisinaire rod, rod trains? And then you're going to be taken on the next slide after this one to a teacher made document where you can practice and play with these rod trains to find out how many different rod trains can be made for any length of rod. So in this picture, you can see that um, you can make these four rod trains for the three rod. And I put um, some colored rods into the Google slide to show you that they're on this grid and um, to help you see the units. And I also did that on the teacher made also. But so this is a three rod. So this rod or this rod, and it's showing you that with this three rod, you can use three of these white or these whatever color that is or you can use one of these colors and one of these or you can use one of these and one of these so what do you notice and wonder about the information that is given to you on this slide and i do want you to do that notice and wonder about this information on this slide Then on the next slide, you're going to complete the assignment by following the link and clicking on this teacher made um, icon and it will take you to your assignment um, and actually I think I'm going to put that teacher made um, link into your Google Classroom, otherwise everybody will be working in the same class as assignment. So um, you will complete the assignment by following the teacher made link on your um, Google Classroom. And then you're going to use the link that's in your Google Classroom and you're going to do a Flipgrid. A Flipgrid is um, a platform that allows you to make a video of yourself. And I will put a tutorial in of how to use the Flipgrid for students. And there are ways to um, put a sticker over your face and things like that. So if you want anonymity or whatever. But when you're finished with the assignment, you're going to share your reflections by completing a Flipgrid video and each class will have their own link to follow to complete that portion of the assignment. So have fun with today's work. Please know that if you have questions, email me, send me a remind text. I can meet with you on Google Meets. I can meet with you on um, FaceTime. I can meet with you on Zoom. Just let me know if you need help or if you have questions. And please, please, please don't get behind in your work. Have a great week and let me know if you need help with my work or any classes work. I miss you guys.